Dragon! Dragon, there you are! Sarah? What are you doing here? Well, after Valentine's Day, you still haven't been acting like yourself. I was worried sick about you. Where have you been? Long story, but it's best to explain to both you and Blader. Do you know where he is? I just dropped by his house, actually, because I thought you were there. But he said you haven't been there at all. He's probably still at his house, but what's this all about? Like I said, I'll explain it to the both of you. Take me to his place. Uh, okay then. Come on. Blader! You there? Hmm? Dragon? You're okay, thank goodness. Hmm. I'm assuming Sarah already filled you in about what happened to me? Yes, yes she did. But what happened to you, and where have you been this whole time? That's what I came here to talk about. Mind if we have a seat? Uh, sure, of course. Go ahead. So what's this all about, Dragon? What happened to you? Okay, here's what you need to know. So, apparently I was just chilling at the... at my place while Sarah was in art class. The, I was gonna watch some TV, but the problem was the TV wasn't working. So I went outside, checked the cable, make sure that everything was working, and things to be working fine. Then I saw this weird one face on the screen, and when I looked away for a moment, it wasn't there. Then it dragged me into the television, pretty much toyed with me, we rap battled, but I lost. And then after that he showed me some illusions that I couldn't even fight. Which pretty much got me scared to the point where I had a heart attack, which ended up bringing me to the hospital. Every now and then I just kept seeing him everywhere I go. So yeah, that's basically what happened. Oh my god, I had no idea. Yeah, it's pretty bad. This has been the most horrifying thing I have ever experienced. I even met up with Peace about this. I thought she was the only person I could go to about this. Dragon, you have us for a reason, you know. We're Team Reliable. Yeah, we're always here for you, hon. I know, I just wasn't thinking straight at the time. I just know I need help with this. I already plan to meet up with Azriel soon. He's going to take me through some mental training. I'm hoping that this would try and fix all this. Don't you think that doing mental training would probably make this worse though? What if it just makes you lose control or, or worse? Hun, I don't care what the risks are. I'll do anything to get this thing out of my head. I will stop at nothing to make sure everything is back to the way it was. I'm not going to let anything get in my way. I, I mean, I understand that, Dragon, but I feel like- Look, I understand what you're trying to say, so just don't waste your breath. I choose to do this on my own, and I'm going to stick with it. Well, you know I always have faith in you and everything that you do. I just hope that you'll be careful this time, please. You've been through so much, and it's starting to worry me even more than before. At least you both understand. I've been starting to question who I trust recently. I'm not going to say names, but they know who they are. You know you can always trust us with anything, Dragon. Yeah. Because after all... We're, we're Team, team reliable. reliable! Thanks, you guys. I don't know where I'd be without you. Hmm. <laughs> Same here, bro. Now, there's one more team that I need to go and see. And then I'm going to meet up with them to start my middle training. Just be safe out there, bro. I love you, hon. Please, be careful out there. I... I really hope he knows what he's doing out there. Yeah. Me too.